Hey guys and welcome in to vlog 22, one of my most edited vlogs ever and most action packed. I, I could do a, a BAM symbol right now like WATCHA! No, no and that's, that's wrong, I'm not going to do that. That's weird. Idiot. <laughs> anyway, uh, right now I want to show you some stuff I did today. I did a lot of stuff. I went all over the world, uh, in Salisbury that is. Not really that many places. But I went to a market that sold cows and sheep and chickens. Which you can see in my 30 day challenge video on uh, on Vlogavolve. Um, which should be up by now. By the time this video goes up it should be up. Hopefully. Um, and also uh, I, I, I went to a courthouse. Went to the cells. And I'll show you all that in a minute. Um, but yeah. So anyway we went to the market. And uh, there was some really weird stuff there. There was like chickens and stuff, and there was there was, there was like sales going on. People were bidding on stuff and bidding on animals and bidding on furniture, and it was all crazy. And it's it's it was very farmer like. I mean, everyone was wearing wax cotton jackets and and those weird hats that they wear in Emmerdale. Scary. Um, <laughs> uh, it was it was very weird, and um, it was kind of odd to see that. I mean, there's quite a lot of people dressed up like that, and it was. It was it was very very farmery. It was very very farmery. So, um, yeah, we went to uh, we went to the bidding place because I found really old laptops. I found this Dell laptop which is about fifteen years old. It looked it looked old. I mean, it looked it, it was running Windows ninety five. That's how old it was, um, and it was literally that thick. No joke at all. And that's with a lid down, obviously, but literally about that thick. I wanted it so bad, just for the fun of it, you know, just to have it. Um, and I really want to do a vlog on it. That would be literally impossible. But um, <laughs> because you can't do media, I don't think. They could do Windows Media Player, but they couldn't do anything else. Anyway, so yeah, that happened. I, I didn't get it because it didn't have any chargers. Stupid. So they're selling it without a charger, which is kind of a shame. I would have so bid on that otherwise. So yeah, anyway, um, <laughs> I, we went to there and then we went to the bidding. We actually went to the bidding hall and I'll show you the video now. Where well, you can actually see the bidding going on. So yeah, that's the bidding. I, I I don't know myself. I I think it's all a bit wrong. Um, that him poking the animal with a stick wasn't very nice. Um, and and he constantly was going oh one two three one two nine nine seven nine. Oh god, he was so fast as well. He didn't he didn't make any bloody sense. So you can't understand a word he was saying. But apparently it's uh, pence to the kilo. So the, one of those one of those cows that was in there sold for like six hundred pounds. Insane. So. That was mind blowing. I was like, "Wow, for a cow, really? Well done. Um, <laughs> you've earned a profit." Um, so yeah, uh, that happened. Then we went, we we we, went, we left from there. I went to town and I uh, went into Game Station. And I asked the manager. He goes, "You're on the top. You're you're near the top of my list. And I need to c talk to you soon." Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. So it may be good. It may be good results. So hopefully, I'm going to get a job in Game Station. Yay! Um, that would be great, and I can't wait. And in there I got um, that Sly Cooper Classics HD Trilogy um, on the on the PS3. Um, it's okay, it's good. I, I, I love the Sly Cooper games on PS2. Uh, I, I, I never owned a Sly Cooper game. I only ever played the demos. But um, they, they have move support, but it's basically just tacked on. It's not very good. So um, you can apparently still use a controller to do it. I don't have move, but I got that. And um, I also got this, but I, 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 in the place I'm going to show you next, and uh, 
Star Wars sticker album. Oh yes, I really wanted it so bad because it's the original Star Wars, um, which is cool. And then you can see like you've got coloring in and everything else. I know, really, really babies, but I don't care. I love Star Wars and I, I love stickers. So um, I've got a whole sticker collection. I'm going to stick all over my stuff. Look at all that. Yeah, awesome. So yeah, all right. Okay, so yeah, we moved on to uh, the City Hall. And in the City Hall, they had, as I said before, the convention, the sci-fi. It was literally, a you're going to see it in this video. It was a sm small room that you could walk around in, like, literally two minutes and look at stuff. It cost six pounds to get in there, not eight. It was a whole family, because my, my family went. My uh, stepmom, stepsister, stepbrother, and my dad. And uh, we all walked around there and everything. And it, it was six pounds for all of us, because the kids got in free. And um, it was really cool to see some of the props from the... Fi and th these are real props, you're going to see. Uh, there are props from the movies and the TV series. There's one from uh, X-Files, which I, I've never recognised. Even my stepmom, who's a big fan of X-Files, didn't even recognise it. So I don't know what the hell that was. If you know what it is, it's a big kind of man with, like, stomach coming out. It's horrible. You, you'll see it. Um, there's other stuff in there, like uh, Yoda. That's pretty damn cool. Uh, there's a Darth Vader's lightsaber signed by um, uh, D David D Dave Pros, the guy who played Darth Vader, anyway. And it's signed by him, which is pretty damn cool. And um, there's there's some other stuff in there, and, and Darth Vader himself. So, really, really, I hope you, you guys enjoy this. I didn't talk throughout it because I just want to go basically show off the stuff. I didn't want to go talking all over it. So, um, <laughs> near the end, I get asked by my stepmom to take a photo next to Darth Vader. So, um, I had to turn the camera around and face it at them when they were taking a photo of me, which is kind of weird. But yeah, so that's going to happen. And uh, yeah, so watch this, and I hope you enjoy it. Oh, I have a picture with it. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to record a video at the same time. It's good. Fine. <laughs> it was him. <laughs> what on earth is this? Oh, this is from the 1998 Lost in Space. The film. That's what I remember. Oh, that's the ship from the. Um... Yeah, the film, not the. The one with the girl that used to be in... I know, I know the film. Five. Yeah. Yeah, that was, he was a pilot in Lost in Space. He was, he was Joey in Friends. Joey? Yeah, Matt LeBlanc's Joey. God's oh, sake, you should know that. <laughs> The 
Borussia. All right. So yeah, that's that. Pretty cool. And I'll see you soon. Bye bye. So yeah, um, that's pretty damn cool. Um, I, I, the thing is, I re the, the next place we moved on to was the uh, courthouse because uh, the place we were in was a city hall, and they had a courthouse and everything, and uh, like a 17th century room with like chandeliers. It was oh beautiful, it really was. And um, and they had uh, a courthouse disused, uh, not used by anyone. It closed down a couple of years ago now, and uh, no one's using it anymore. So basically, they opened it up today to let people walk around and look. And um, we went in there. And it was, as you see in this video, it's only a short video, but you'll see how, how amazing it looks. And there's this big balcony up top. Really, really cool. And, um, yeah. And also, uh, and then after that, I'll show you the cell. I'm going to probably put them straight together. Because we went straight downstairs after that and went to the cells, which is cool. So, watch that. Watch both of these. And I hope you enjoy them. An old disused courthouse. Got the thing here. Apparently, the cell. What, what's down there? The cells. The cells? Oh, awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna go get gelled up. Going to the cells, so oh let's see what happens. There's a blocker room. Oh, how, what the hell? A light turned on its own. There's music coming from the cells. Well, there's <laughs> music. Yeah, they're, they're living it up in there. And a person. Oh, so if you're walking through. Go ahead. Thanks. You can see how many apple leaves in the cells. Keep going, man. He's down here. Oh, wow. Look at that. <gasps> the cells keep chairs and guitars. Oh. Right, room three. They go down on the same the They cut the floor down here. That's what we practice on. And now we've got little James in there. God, I mean, look at. Imagine being in here all night, it's horrible. They would say in here all night, this is when they used to be able to call. Oh. I mean, there's no toilet. <laughs> well, you can't go on there or under there. Oh, that's horrible. There's nothing in there. Oh, I see your station. That's what sound should look like, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Nothing in them. They're records and pictures. On, off, reset. Mm. What happens if you press the red button? Press it. <laughs> Take a copy of There's no way out there. Ooh. <laughs> What's up? Ah. Oh. that what you came down to? Uh, oh, so yeah. All, all that you saw from where one was was as you came down. Ah, it's a locked door. So the left is warm. And you said, throw your fat boys where he is. Oh, damn. It's like a painted door. Safe. He's in it. 
pretty stupid of oh. Alright. So yeah, that's the cells in the old courthouse. <coughs> but until next time, which will probably be in, in a few minutes, that's me out. <laughs> right, goodbye. So yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching my vlog, my most actual impact and most edited vlog I've ever done. Ever. And um, I'm going to go read my Guinness Book of Records Gamers Edition. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm going to look, I'm going to read out a random fact right now. That's for you people at home watching this video. I'm going to find something. Um, I'm not in here annoyingly. I wish I was. My most sexiest voice in gaming. But no. <laughs> Alas. All right. Uh, survival horror narrative adventure. Um, I thought, hang on, there's one right at the start here. You know, Dance Dance Revolution. It's a, uh, it's a. Um, they have them in arcades. Uh, the, you kind of like play, they play the music, and there's like a dance map, and you, you basically jump around this like metal dance map thing in the arcades years ago. Dance Dance Revolution, and um, this guy. Uh, let's see if I can find it here. Uh, next page. Yeah, <laughs> longest marathon playing Dance Dance Revolution. Um, you can see that there. Um, so that's that. I'll read out. Uh, getting his groove on, Chris McGurvin danced for 13 hours and 33 minutes and 56 seconds, of course, um, on the on the latest Dance Dance Revolution arcade machine. Wow, that's insane. I'm sorry, but you, I, I would not. I would. I would literally collapse. I would. I would collapse. I wouldn't be able to do it for 13 hours, but that's insane. Random fact for you. Thanks for watching. Please comment below on what you think. And uh, is this well edited or not? Because I, I don't know because I, I'm, I'm recording. It's a very weird process doing this. So I'm recording this vlog in bits and then plopping, <laughs> plopping, that's a weird word. I'm placing the video from today in into the separate bit. So um, if, it, it kind of, if it kind of stutters it, between transitions, um, then that's not my fault and I'm sorry. But yeah, thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you tomorrow, and hopefully I'll have a Fallout New Vegas video up um, tomorrow. I'm gonna do a. I'm gonna. I promise you, I'll do a Fallout New Vegas video tomorrow because I haven't done one, and because uh, I've been too busy downloading bloody games. Oh man, I'm bad. So yeah, thanks for watching. But until next time, that's me out.